Now, nearly at the same time, a little bit later started, a little bit earlier completed. So the world record never went to finally to the Stonecutter Bridge, uh, but went to Sutong across the, I think it's the Hoang Ho, the Yellow River in China. Uh, 1,088 meters, nearly done, view from the tower. Uh, transportation of the last element uh, by barge, lifting of the last element, and then of course the installation of the last element is always a little tricky. Uh, it's normally precisely then measured the distance, and very often the last piece is fabricated too long to be able to cut it off a little bit exactly to where you land. I mean, after 500 meters each side, you can't really normally foretell it's on the millimeter. But in addition, what you have to do is you have to spread the two beams which are already erected in order to be able to lift in, to thread in the last element. So this temporary uh, uh, scaffold uh, um, beam here, truss girder, is used to spread the two halves, which of course at their fixed points must provide the possibility for 10 centimeter sliding. Open up, thread in, lift in the last element, and then come back. And you've measured all that extremely carefully at night without temperature. And then the two should fit very closely so that you can weld around. That's the same with all the final centerpieces of steel cable state bridges.